Commission donated $90,000 to East Tennessee Children's Hospital in response to heavy media criticism during the Ole Miss football game last fall. Remember when Tennessee fans let the referees know how they felt about the game? Trash came flying from the stands onto the field in the fourth quarter. It delayed the game and caused strong criticism from the media. Brent Baltzer wanted to respond with positivity. You know, we know that we're not a bunch of hooligans. We're, you know, we're, we're good people. And these good people decided to use their wallets to fight back against the criticism. It was sort of a way to harvest all that, all that um, anger and angst from the fan base and harvest that into something good and just sort of change the narrative by showing, you know, that there's another side to all this. The $90,000 will go to fill the greatest needs for patients suffering from health problems such as mental and behavioral health, babies born dependent on opioids, and obesity. Baltzer and former Vols wide receiver and current radio host Jason Swain teamed up to make it happen. They talked on the phone before, but the two men had never met until they presented the check at East Tennessee Children's Hospital. I'm really happy for him, proud of him, that you know, he, it was on his heart to, to move forward and start this, and then everyone backed him, so just really proud of Brent, really cool to meet him. Both received football signed by Vols head coach Josh Heupel as gifts. Message after message from fans um, just saying thank you for, for doing this. This is the real UT, you know, and this is a way for fans to show, like, what, we, what we're really about. If you want to donate to Children's Hospital, you can head to etch.com slash donate.